Kali Linux. All right, so let's do this. Today, this video is essentially based on popular demand because a lot of people have actually been asking me how to live boot into Kali Linux or how to create a live bootable USB for Kali Linux or just how to work with Kali Linux in general. And I'm not an expert at that at all, but I do know how to create a live bootable USB for Kali Linux. Kali Linux, that's really hard to say fast. Anyway, that's what we're gonna do today, so let's go. First, go to Kali.org, then head over to the Downloads tab. Here you will find the Kali Linux live disk image. Download that. While that is downloading, go to balina.io slash etcher. Here you can download the etcher software to flash the Kali image onto your USB. Go through the installation process, and there you go. You have what you need to create your live bootable USB. Plug in your USB stick of choice. Format it in FAT32. CalCali. Now open up Etcher and select the Kali Live disk image from your downloads. Select a target device you want to flash the disk image onto. Make sure to choose the right USB stick. And then flash. And you're done. You now have a live bootable USB stick with Kali Linux. Eject the drive and restart your computer. Wait forever for it to restart. Press the key that will get you into your BIOS on your computer. In BIOS, change the order of boot priority so that if your USB stick is plugged in, then your computer will try to boot from that first. Now it should boot from the USB. Now select the live system and hit enter. And we're in. That's how you live boot into Kali Linux. All right, so that was a pretty quick one, but I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that you actually learned or was able to follow along with the instructions that I had. The goal of this video was to essentially make a tutorial that's kind of more interesting than your regular old tutorials. So I hope I kind of got close to that, but it's sort of a balance between teaching and also making it interesting because like I said, the goal was to make an interesting tutorial and I wanted this to essentially be something that people that weren't really interested in Kali Linux or like how to live boot into it, that they could also enjoy watching this video. So um, I hope that you got something out of it, whether it was to learn it or whether it was just entertainment from watching how to do it. And it was kind of ro Mr. Robot inspired, of course. And I think that they shoot things in a really interesting way. They shoot programming in a really interesting way. So that was essentially my inspiration. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you learned something and I hope I'll see you in the next one tomorrow.